Okay. Alright, here with Kella. And Kella, what a game to come out here and play against a D1 team. We played pretty well. Disappointing end, but you got to get over that. Yeah, I thought we came out and played hard and just, you know, done the things that we do, I think. And I, I thought it kept us in the game until there at the end, but it was a good effort by us all together, I thought. And the three point shots were falling for you. Did it just yeah. feel right tonight? Yeah, it did. I, you know, I was I was getting pretty good looks. My teammates were setting me up really good, and then I just was blessed to make them tonight. It kind of takes a performance like that to beat a D1 team. Were you thinking in your head every time one went in, like, this is what we needed? Yeah, I, you know, I was like, you know, we need to knock down some shots, especially to, to beat this kind of caliber of a team. And we were doing that, and I think that's what kept us in the game, plus our defense especially. What would you credit the, the end of the game? Was that just their depth and athleticism finally I taking think, over? Yeah, I think so, too. You know, you know, we tried to kind of press them a little bit bit and they're a really quick team so they kind of just ran out on us but of course you're not happens. of course from here on it gets of course you get like a tuck tomorrow but after yeah. that when you play NAI teams will you look at this performance and talk about it as a team yeah we, we really look at this the effort especially put forth you know we try to play up to their potential and that's what we'll have to do you know for sure in conference because we got some really good teams and just think talk your thoughts on playing Kentucky tomorrow just something you're going to have fun doing oh yeah it's an incredible experience I think that we're going to have tomorrow you know a lot of us that especially are from Kentucky it's going to be a big thing playing at Memorial Coliseum well, we can't wait to watch it so thanks a lot Kel. thank you Dan.